Hey everybody, this is Matt and we're at Texas Toast Guitars. Thanks for watching. Today I'm going to show you guys a cool tool and here it is. This is a, uh, it's a, it is a piece of aluminium that is a drill guide for Telecaster string through ferrules and um, that way you get nice, uh, nice straight string ferrules every time when you are doing a Telecaster guitar like this. So um, the uh, the customer here wants a, um, a hip shot bridge with string through ferrules. So I have I've already marked it where where the strings go through the body. I mean this this is really more of a video about how to uh, how to use this tool than how to use the hip shot bridge. So um, I'm not going to go deep dive into how I did that. But um, the first thing we have to do is we have to drill the six holes for the strings to go through the body, and we're gonna do that now. So there's the hole poking through with just the, the Brad Point drill bit poked through. I, I have my drill set up to where it only goes through to that, that far. I'm gonna drill all six of them, and then I'm gonna come back and, and chase the, uh, the outside two, and you'll see why here in a second. All right, so notice I don't have any blowout of wood on the back there. If I go to where just the brad point pokes through, then I can chase it through the other side. By the way, I forgot to mention I'm using a 1 8 inch drill bit because that's what the, uh, what well, we're getting to it. Now I'm just going to put the brad point back in those holes. All right. That's what it looks like. Now, guys, you don't have to do it the way I do it. That's just the way I do it. I don't care how you do it. All right, the tool comes with two little steel pins, and they are eighth to five sixteenths, and then something in the middle there. I threw the instructions away because I'm an American and I know how to do stuff. So the idea is that you put the, um, the two pins in um, one of the holes that you just drilled, and then see how it lines up perfectly on this, this set, but doesn't go on this set? That's because there are two, two, two sets of Telecaster um, uh, spacings, and this is the one that we need to use. So it's a cool thing. All right, so now what we're going to do is eh, we're going to switch bits to a 5 16 and we're going to drill for the ferrules. All right, I got my 5 16 bit in here. I'm just going to... Um, use the guide to um, show me exactly where I need to drill. I'm going to drill the four that don't have these little pins. Then I'm going to move the pins and drill the outside two. And voila! Now, some people are going to go, well, how deep do these holes need to be? Uh, for the ferrules that we're going to be using on this one, it doesn't matter because they have the top hat thing, and uh, you just press it down until the, uh, the rim just barely touches the top there. All right, so as you guys can see, that is a pretty easy way to uh, turn a job that can take a long time and can get sideways pretty fast. Um, uh, and turn it into an easier job. And there's something about this that like if they're a little bit off, people get all sorts of bent out of shape about it. So this tool, um, I got this one on Reverb. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below. I had to pay for this. Um, so the company that sold it was is like, you know, some email name thing. But uh, so far so good. And it was, um, they had free shipping, so that was cool. And uh, so this gets the Texas Toast seal of approval. If you guys are doing a bunch of Telecasters, you might want to think about picking one of these up. I don't know. So until next time, this is Matt at Texas Toast reminding you, if you're so smart, build it yourself. That's what I do. Thanks for watching, y'all.